Hi, this is Scott Garibay. Today we're going to talk about Dungeons & Dragons 5th Edition, and we're specifically going to talk about whether you should TikTok your 5th Edition campaign. Let's talk about why. Okay, so let's, let's talk about how this would work. So let's talk about TikTok for a minute. TikTok is a massively successful new um, social media site. Uh, it's incredibly popular with young people. It got a lot of traction with music videos with with generally young people dancing okay that that was its platform right so you know I'm not opposed to new um, new social media sites at all I'll jump on any social media site that does something new there's the catch almost no social media sites that are coming out do anything new I was like the TikTok is not doing anything useful like you could do a one minute video on on YouTube this is then why do you need TikTok? So I never joined TikTok because I'm like, there's nothing new here, right? However, uh, I've been starting to pay attention to TikTok. Here's why. A couple reasons. One, it is massive, right? Uh, it ha it, its success levels are through the roof, uh, and it's done extremely well for a new social media site. Not all, Many new social media sites go out of business within a year or two, right? Vine failed. Right, and I was like, "What's the difference between a six-second video and a one-minute video?" Right. Well, I guess it's ten times longer, but you know, like it's Twitter a video, right? But again, like, who needs this, right? It's just this is literally just a length thing, right? And but the reality is, whatever I said really didn't matter because TikTok was blowing up and it was huge. So two things have have brought TikTok full circle to where I think we should consider. And here's the answer. You should TikTok your campaign, your video. You should absolutely TikTok your Dungeons & Dragons 5th Edition game. I'll tell you why and I'll tell you how. Okay, so the reason why is the reason that TikTok has done so well is one, they have content that is fun and engaging. There's no, that's not debatable, right? So my kids watch uh, TikToks all the time and increasingly they're bringing them to me and they're saying, hey dad, check this out. Right now, they don't bring me like dancing videos because they know that ain't my jam, right? But like uh, recently, they they brought me um, these two huskies howling with a uh, with a golden retriever behind them. It's one minute long, and it is one of the funniest things I've ever seen. These two uh, these two huskies just start howling, right? It's all it's thirty seven seconds long. It ripped through our house so fast, right? Every single person in the house saw it. Watch and just put it on a heavy rotation. Just watch it again and again and again, because it's so funny, right? When you when you, it's hard to explain why it's funny. It's just outrageously funny, and 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 everything about it is charming and winsome and and funny, right? And it just like every person in the house loved it. We all loved, and every person watched it on their phone separately, right? And you didn't even need TikTok to watch it, right? Now. All that's going on, and there's more. Uh, one of my daughters brings me like book TikToks where they talk about a book in one minute, and they're really helpful and useful and good, right? But here's the kicker. I was I, I asked my kids, I'm like, how did this succeed? Why did TikTok succeed when Vine died? And neither one of them, they gave me, both gave me some good information, but I found out when I watched Flagrant. Andrew Schultz has a show called Flagrant 2. And uh, he's a comedian, and he just talks about like all kinds of different things. And he had a guest on, and they were talking about TikTok. And he said the reason TikTok blows up and has done so well is that when you put on your first, second, or third video, when you have a decent video to put up, they will distribute. They the, TikTok distributes virality. Okay, so if I go onto TikTok and I put in a TikTok, right? TikTok will send that to literally a quarter million to a half a million viewers. And so when I put up my first TikTok, I can get five, 10,000, 25,000, even 100,000 views, right? And the reason why is any new user, TikTok will put them on blast, right? So that's the reason they are distributing virality. That is new. That is not done on most sites, right? So if you're new, they're gonna give you that first good hit, right? Like that, like that's really the model, right? They're like, and but then a lot of TikTok users realize that doesn't continue. It's just your first, second, or third video, right? And they don't continue to distribute virality. How do we apply that to our Dungeons and Dragons fifth edition game? Well, here you go. If you get a new table, if you have a table and you got two, three, four players, and you're willing to add one more. And that new player comes in, 
do you distribute the virality, okay? Do you make the powerfulness of the new player accentuated, right? Do you make it so that when a new player comes in, they are a rock star in game one? A huge rock star. Where basically, almost like when you do a, when you play a board game, right? If you're going to show somebody a new board game and you want to play 100 games of them, you lose. You don't win, okay? Because I'll tell you right now, people don't know if they like a board game they lost playing, right? They know they like a board game they, they won playing. So Because so, if they lose the first time they play a video game, uh, a board game, they got to figure out if they just didn't like losing or if they didn't like the board game, right? But if you punch the experience for uh, for a player for a new player character a bard sings their t- if they have folk hero on their sheet a bard sings their tale in um in the in the tavern right uh when they come in they're the one that finds the magical sword because the crate they opened had the magical sword no roll right they just get a magical sword that's three that's three levels higher than what they should experience right um there's all kinds of things you could do at the 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 non-player character like when they you know when they go up against a villain and they uh the invil- the villain is intimidated with knowledge they know about the player character before before right before a role is even made right you can up a player character and make sure that they have a truly epic session in session 1 i think we should it's tough. It's it's not really great for, you know, it's not going to be a great feeling for the rest of your players. But guess what? We got to grow this hobby, man. It's too small. It is too small. It is too small. TikTok has shown a very, very clear model for success. Doesn't seem smart to just wait and do nothing with it. TikTok, your fifth edition campaign. Make sure you get a new player in there. They're going to have a better session than everybody else. It's just the way it is, man. Like, it's it's the way of the world. That's my take. What do you think? Let me know in the comments below. Please consider liking and subscribing and have a wonderful millennium.